get ready to go out no matter what the occasion is. We all want to look our best. And sometimes you see that wow effect on certain people and we always say, how do I get that wow effect? Exactly. Joining us today is Jennifer Butler, my color expert. You are the guru of analyzing color and how to use it not only to communicate but to express your best personality and your authenticity. Exactly. So talk us through it. Well, I work with over 4,000 colors mm -hmm. and I work with over 64 different personalities. So I thought it might be fun to show our colors and show how we create, a, how a basic palette is created. Okay. The first thing is what we call the sacred triad and it's your hair, skin, and eyes. So let's Hair, look, skin, and eyes. Hair, skin, and eyes. So okay. we actually match your hair. So yours is a black brown. Okay. I'm going to okay. hold up. These are the colors that you made for me. Right. And then mine is silver. Okay. Right. Then the second neutral, I have sort of the deep burgundies and black and yours is in that wonderful russet color, which is a neutral of your skin tone. And then we What's have... What's russet? Oh, you mean rust? Mm -hmm. this, the second column. The there you go. The, so this is mm -hmm. the neutral of my skin tone? Yes. Okay. And then the third, this toffee, comes from your eyes and your skin. This? The third column. Third there column. Go. So this is my hair, this is my eyes, and this is my skin. And from that, that is how each person can find their own color? Exactly. Before we go on, why is this important? Who cares? Does it really matter? Well, because of the personality and our coloring is key to who we are. And there's only one of us on the planet. So in order to be yourself, you need to wear your own coloring so people can uh, figure out who you are. And so you can express and communicate better. Exactly. Okay. How do you know if you're wearing the wrong color? Well, I think most people will usually uh, tell each other often. And oftentimes people are sensitive to their skin tone. Like people will try something and they'll say, oh, that makes my skin tone more yellow. Yes. Right? Yes. Exactly. So that's so, usually So key. innately we kind of know. I think I think we know innately, and we're often attracted to the opposite. So I was uh, when I, before I wore my red, I was in your red, for example, I, because I thought that was a very sophisticated rust color. I didn't really like my red as much. But you, but you, so okay, all right. right. So you learned, but that's the, that's being attracted to the opposite. Yes. We have 20 seconds left. We have two pictures of you in gold and silver. Okay. Talk to us about these two photographs. So the first is you the power of the neutrals, where I'm wearing my white and silver, which is a breakthrough when I went from my dark hair to my natural hair color, which is white. Okay. I stopped dyeing it. And the third is the the yellow, which is actually the pastel of my eyes, the lights of my uh, brown eyes are gold. So oftentimes a brown eye color has amber lights or gold lights or topaz lights. So the point with all of this is that go with your skin, hair, and eyes, yes. figure out your authenticity, and wear it. And, and express your personality. Love it. And that's better living.